What's goody, guys? Thanks for joining your Smile Tarot. I'm Lauren. What is going on, loves? I'm here to do a collective reading, my loves. Thank you guys for clicking on if you're new to the video, to the channel. Thank you guys for being here. Okay, those of you that have been rocking with me for so long, guys, welcome to the channel, loves. I love you so much. No, I do. I do. I do. Know that I do. All right, let's see what's going on for the collective. What's the messages? What's the messages, spirit, for the collective? What's going on here? Broke ass. Okay. Somebody believes you to be broke. Yeah. Someone here is trying to block your money because they're broke. They're having money problems here. Something like that. Yeah, somebody having money problems here. Okay. All right. Yeah, but their tactics are played out. Somebody has to tell you you're broke so you can end up being, for, so you can be blocked from something. What the hell? Yeah, they be bring you dirty ass offers in. So who broke? <laughs> mm-hmm. Somebody's not doing well money-wise, okay? Yeah, you dodged a bullet here for many of you. A played out energy that just keeps playing themselves out. Doing the same shit, different days. Someone's stuck in their ways, all right? Someone likes to cry to get attention. I like to say they're gonna do stuff to hurt themselves and things like that. Be careful of that. Yeah, they hustling your ass because they broke. Mm-hmm. They focused on money and getting paid. Somebody here might be wanting to marry you for money, okay? They're trying to block things out your life. Yeah. Could be karmic friends that you also have involved that are involved in this. Yeah, because you're moving in silence. So you moving in silence triggers somebody, okay? They're played out. They're trying to block you, okay? Fishing for comments. Somebody needs a lot of attention. Yeah. Somebody wants to come kissing your ass because they broke too. Could be a group of people, y'all. Damn. Spirit, what's going on for the collective? What's going on for the collective? Yeah, they're confused as to why they can't hustle you. They're karmic as hell. You can't trust them. They got secret, they got secret competition and all that. Yeah, and look, you unbothered. Oh, guys, there's so many messages coming out. Spirit's like, Lauren, keep talking. You ask for these messages. Okay, Spirit, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, you unbothered by these karmic assholes. You are. Nobody is your, that's your friend or truly somebody that cares about you going to be in competition. What kind of shit is that, man? We're supposed to work together and build together. Friendship or not, it doesn't matter. Shit, like for real. Spirit, what's going on my collective? Nightmares. Someone's having nightmares here, okay? Yeah, because they're curious about you. Someone might be having nightmares because they don't know what you're doing. And that caused them to have these nightmares. Like, they might be having their subconscious things that are going on that are really not happening. So, they dream about the shit. Comes, these dreams just come to them. They also might be having uh, insomnia. A lot of losing sleep here. A lot of losing sleep. They're so confused. That's why you're so unbothered by their tactics to block you from your money and everything. Yeah, no facts. They lie. That's for one. They lie. What's for the collective spirit? They want you back, okay? Somebody wants you back around, y'all. Wants you back doesn't have to be somebody just a lover, y'all. Could be friends and family that want you back around. Because they miss blocking you from things. But their energy is played out. You dodging their bullets, yeah, and you uninterested. So there's someone's trying to bring you in here. You're not interested at all. They broke. They might be having a lot of money problems. Whatever it may be, you're not going to make it your problem. That's what I feel here. Y'all, my cards are kind of tilted or something. I apologize. I'm really trying to figure out how to get this to just be straight. It's it's hard for me, okay? It's hard for me to get that down. All right, y'all. That ain't even important. All right, Spirit. Let's see what we got going on for the collective. What's going on for the collective, Spirit? Let's go into the tarot, Spirit. Thank you so much for the amazing blessings, my friends. My friends. Okay. Yeah, Three of Swords, y'all. Got that in the collective reading yesterday. Three of Swords. I don't feel like this is your energy collective, though. I have to be honest here. This is a little different. Somebody's bothered by your, um, your rise. That's what I feel here. You rising above the drama. You rising above their played out tactics. You moving in silence. You dodging their ass. They fishing for comments and shit curious about you it's like somebody wants to test you to see if you still have some feeling for them yeah they mad 
They upset. Yeah, four of pentacles because you released their energy. You released their energy. And that, that's the thing. When you release people's energy away from you, not away from you, but when you release people's energy, you start getting to understand who they are. Okay? You start seeing what they are. You start feeling uh, uh, vitality, like this newness about the energy you're around because they're draining. Somebody here was draining you. Yeah, King of I just said dra draining you. King of Pentacles in the reverse. Somebody don't have money, so they feel like they need to just go on ahead and sometimes they like talk to people or try to get involved with people that have money. An opportunist. Somebody here is like that. And they're angry. They want to message you. You got good news coming in, my dear collective. Okay, something good is about to happen in your favor. It might be it might be cash flow. Something coming in. Okay, and somebody is sitting over here upset because they can't hustle you. They can't block you from your money or your yeah. Look at this, the tower. Oh yeah, spirits like better red recognize. Okay, you better recognize. Could be a Scorpio. Could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, a Sagittarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay. Yeah, somebody's like having a, a tower here. And this ain't the tower. Aha, no, it ain't. This is like I broke down all that fake shit you were trying to build up in your head, okay? They got multiple people watching you as well. I'm seeing that here. I saw that uh, Page of Swords in reverse. It's all gang stalking, though, I get. Yeah, Ten of Swords. Look at this. Like, what the... F I told you this is a regular tower moment for these uh for this energy collective. Whatever you released, they're feeling that shit. Cause they try to block you out. Okay? Somebody tries to have the nerve to try to talk behind your back, called you broke, but they the ones played out. Okay? Two cups here at the bottom of the deck in the reverse. This might have been something that was very beautiful at one point, or maybe there's not some some here where you and this person see eye to eye, they're so money focused and you're so love and caring and everything. So it didn't balance right. So someone's heartbroken and sad. I think someone's crying. That's what I think is going on here. Spirit, clarify that three of swords for me. Please, Spirit, clarify that three of swords. For the collective, please. Three of swords for the collective. Yeah, the moon. In the reverse. Something's came out. Okay? Something came out. You have facts. Someone here has no facts and you have facts. I'm looking at no facts. I'm seeing facts in big letters. Somebody makes shit up, though. Because they care about you. It's like somebody's trying to bat the beehive. I used that before. That's what I heard in another reading I did. I don't know what reading that was. Was that a Taurus reading? I don't know. But somebody's like trying to get a reaction out of you. They want to block you from your blessings because you're moving in silence. They want to know what you're doing. They're so mad you're unbothered. And they want you back. They want to come and kiss your ass because they're confused. They like fishing for compliments and all kinds of stuff. They want you to say something to them. Yeah, not a cups in reverse. It's not happening. It's not going in the way someone thought it was. You're uninterested. Their tactics and whatever they're doing is played out. You're, you're dodging the bullets. It's like it makes no sense here. Four wands here at the bottom of the deck now. You might be celebrating, going to a baby shower this weekend or something. I don't know what I'm saying this weekend. A birthday party. King of Cups in reverse, because they ass is just... Now look, guys, we got the King of Pentacles in reverse and the King of Cups in reverse. Someone here could be a masculine. Don't have to be. This could be a female. It's a motherfucker. Someone here, my dear collective, is very, very piggish. Piggy, piggy. I need, I need, I need, I need. Emotionally codependent on you, but they're not willing to give anything out. Stably, uh, financially dependent on you. They're not willing to give none back. They just want to block everything coming in your favor so they can have it for themselves. Hmm. They triggered, y'all. Don't laugh. It ain't funny. They triggered by this. You're moving in silence. Got them mad. They got they're mad, y'all. They mad. Nine of Cups here in the reverse. I got that yesterday too in my reading with the Three of Swords. Yeah, we got the Devil and the Queen of Swords here. The Devil. The Devil here is your back is turned to this person. You are being very, 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 very truthful. You're being logical about something. Someone wants you to be so emotional because they're co they're codependent emotionally and financially on you. What the hell? They're having a tower. Spirit, what's this tower? Clarify this tower. Yeah, look. This tower, this tower is being clarified by the uh, Nine of Wands. 
Not a wand. So somebody's player ass ways. I feel like a player energy coming in and out. I think it's got them struck up in that tower. Yeah. Two of swords at the bottom of the deck now, collective. Here, what's the ten of swords? Six of cups. Somebody from your past. If you see the six of cups is here, this woman's back is turned to this knight of wands. Someone comes into this energy where they make things seem like it's a good, beautiful house. They make you feel like childhood in some way, shape, or form. You might know this person for a very long time. And then they run back out the same way. They run out and they come back kissing ass. They confuse their damn self. Yeah, five of cups in reverse. We're not sad here. We're not doing that. I don't want to be depressed forever. Yeah, because of your ass being sneaky. King of Swords in reverse. Someone here, you would think that this is, we just saw the Queen of Swords in the upright. You would think this is a match. No, it's not. It's someone that lies that versus someone that always tells the truth, goes by having integrity. This King of Swords in reverse does not do that. They lie, they lie, they make up, they fabricate things. All kinds of weird shit. Spirit, what's this not a cups here in the reverse? For the collective. This could be you. Yeah, see, someone blocking it out. They like, no. No, no, and no. Seven of Wands, I don't want this selfish energy, okay? I'm releasing your energy. I'm releasing myself from you. I'm holding back from you. You're too greedy and you're too damn emotionally manipulative. And someone feels so backstabbed and hurt by that. Yeah, because you're in your faith, okay? You're in your faith. My daughter, y'all. We've been having the coughs around this house. You're in your faith and someone is not. That makes them feel challenged. It makes them feel weak. It makes them feel insecure. That's crazy as hell. You blocking this out. Spirit, what's this king of cups in the reverse here? Mm -hmm. Hermit in the reverse. God dang. Virgo energy. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. You're not Libra Aquarius. Taurus Virgo Capricorn. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, uh, Leo, Aries, Sag. I mean, it's all here, y'all. It's all here. It's all here. It's all here. Yep. King, Queen of Pentacles in the upright. Look at that. Look at how one court, uh, not court card, but these cards here will be in the upright. And then the king or the queen will be in the reverse. I've had that with, there's two sets here. I've had the Queen of Pentacles in the upright, the King of Pentacles in the reverse, then I saw the Queen of Swords in the upright and the King of P and the Queen of Swords in the reverse. Okay, y'all, I normally don't do gender, but I'm going to go ahead and see what I'm seeing here. There's a masculine energy. It does not have to be male or female, so let me get that straight. Versus a feminine energy. Someone that's just very loving, very nurturing, very calm. Uh, maybe not be calm, but, you know, whatever. They have integrity. They have self-respect. Someone here is trying to utilize, like they could attach to you, like they are, that, like they are um, entitled to, to what's going on in your life. No. And yeah, they're not changing that. They're stuck in their ways. But it's played out. You dodged a bullet here. Someone by so bad wants to be attached to you. And it's got a lot to do with money. I don't know why I feel that. You're about to get good news. Like a blessing or something is going to come into your favor. It's going to cause you to move forward away from this energy. Some of you need to do some cord cutting. Because someone feels like, I'm the king and I'm your queen. and I'm the No, you're not. No, you're not. You're using me. Okay? You're doing too much. Not a cup's in the reverse. No. Okay, no. I just don't want to. I don't want to deal with this. I don't want to deal with this. Look at that. I can't make this shit up. Look at this. Now the Queen of Cups is in the upright. The King of Cups is in the reverse. So, so far, we've seen the Queen of Pentacles in the upright, the Queen of Swords in the upright, and the Queen of Cups in the upright. The Kings are all reversed. Eight of Pentacles in the reverse. Whatever they're doing is not going to work. You're blocking this energy out. Someone doesn't really make wise decisions, okay? Someone wants to make you feel like they ghosted you when truly you ghosted their ass. Okay? This is a masculine energy for many of you. All right? Collective. Hmm. Yeah, that's the truth. Five of Pentacles. It's time to leave somebody out in the cold for good. Maybe you're not with this person right now, but there's a masculine energy that's very, very stingy. Okay? Broke, broke ass, blocking, played out, moving silence. Someone, they need three of swords here. It, something came out, and now, okay, this is weird, collective. Cancer energy. Someone's upset because their secrets came out, so they're heartbroken because you released them? Baby, love you too. The King of Cups and the Queen and the King of Pentacles in the reverse? You released them. You're letting them go. 
Yeah, look, three of cups now in the reverse. Someone does a lot of gossiping. They talk a lot. They talk, 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 talk. Yeah, look, they talk and watch. Like, it's gain stalking here. This is pure gain stalking, you guys. Someone's confused here because the simple fact is that you're blocking them off. They're broken. Someone wants something for the Queen of Pentacles came out again. Okay. Can't help but see the king in the reverse and the queen in the upright. This person, there's a distorted masculine here. Their way of thinking, it could be, listen, you guys, a masculine energy could be a male or a female. It does not matter about their genitalia, okay? I want people to know that. Because I, I, I know there's those energies. It's just the energy. It's just the energy. I don't feel like gender is like to be on my channel anyway. I feel strongly about it. I'm sorry, y'all, I do. Now the king of swords is in the uprights. Now they're in the upright. Look at this. Because it was just in the reverse. So now someone wants to be on your level. Because this tower blowing up in their face and they feel backstabbed by you. So now the queen's in the upright. The queen's in the upright anyway, but the king of pentacles is not. Somebody's broke, y'all, and they want you for money. Not a sword here in the upright. Somebody wants to claim they're coming towards you with truth, but it's lies. It feels like lies here. Yeah, because someone doesn't like your face. They watch you. Nah, I don't like that. Somebody that goes against someone's faith with God and stuff. Nah. Your faith is pure. Someone makes fun of it. They say you're a fool. You're not. Don't believe that shit. Somebody thinks your spirituality is a fool energy. It's not. Don't believe that shit. They watching. They're so immature here. They never get the facts, okay? Ten of Wands here at the back of the deck. Now you done put these burdens down. Now everybody wants to go in this up in arms and go, oh, blocking and oh, my heart. And then, you snake, you know doggone well that your secrets came out and you heard. Oh, oh man, you, you playing. What's this King of Swords in the upright spirit? Awareness. Awareness. Someone's kind of awake. Some, not kind of. Someone's awakened to something, but they're still not doing right. Someone's like lying here. Lying, gossiping. Yeah, I'm telling the truth. This is the this is the ace of swords here. Six of swords, you're moving away from it. Like someone wants to stay attached to third parties and stuff like that. Let so be it. But they're not gonna come and take off you and cut and, and block you. Okay, and come in kissing your ass because they confused. They hearts broken, they had a tower moment. This person broke their own heart, they backstabbed themselves. Somebody here was in and out of your life for a long time, collective. It's played out. Don't come to me. I'm a dog, Joe ass. Don't do that. Like, someone here is just, I don't know. They feel like you ghosted them, but now it's like, mm mm. It's like they kind of find out or sat down and realize, oh, I've been ghosted. They found out. Tower moment. Oh, no. And the Ten of Swords. And no, this can't be happening. It is happening. This is a reading for somebody. It's not for everyone, okay? It's not for everyone. A tower again before I. Okay, y'all. Y'all don't hear me though. The Ace of Swords in this deck. Well, there's a masculine here that's like, they, there's a way of thinking is you need to, uh uh. You need to please me. Even though I call you suffering and lack and energy and fear and things like that, and I always have you isolated up in your head. But guess what? I, I like to be deceptive anyway. Okay, but I need to know your moves. I need you to come bring your energy back to me. Why? I'm watching you. I'm watching you. Here we are watching. Pocket watching. Pocket watching. What's going on here, spirit? Thank you for the messages. Oh, wow. Self-care, yep. Queen of Pentacles right there looking very beautiful. The feminine energy here is magnificent. All the cards for the feminine are in the upright. Can't tell me anything. Yeah. Someone's had a breakthrough through limitations and fears. Because someone put them, someone would like to put, put you there. Okay. The feminine energy involved in the situation. Okay. Yeah. Someone feels rejected because you've awakened. Like, come on. Somebody's against your faith. They feel rejected because you're connecting with God or spirit. Yeah. Mm -mm. Someone's being blocked out. Maybe your angels. Spirit, what else do we have here for the collective? Yeah. Look at this. Purpose, North Node, following your North Node, going towards your purpose. You found it, you know it, and someone here feels entitled. I feel entitlement. That's my king or queen. 
because I said we were dating or because we might have been married and we got divorced, you still want a piece. That's just re weird. Now I'm taking care of myself, nurturing my pentacle. You keep taking my damn pentacle. You thieving, hungry, greedy ass you. You keep taking it. When I come up with the truth, you want to lie. When I come in with love, care, and nurturing, you want to sit there and take it for granted and act like you ain't got feelings. You see right through this. You see through it. <clears throat> they can wear a mask all they want to. There's a soul tie here between you and somebody else. It's entitlement. Someone needs to do some cord cutting. It's a negative soul tie. They make pinky promises with you outside on the beach or whatever at night, whatever the hell it is. Yeah, they want to talk to you. They want to communicate, but they toxic as shit. Why are they toxic, Lauren, you ask? Well, they have third parties, my love. They have third parties, and they, they like to make you feel suffering and shit. What? You get your ass on. I'm blocking that broke ass away. No. Look, it ain't about your money that you have. It's not. But what do you stand for behind it? You think you expect yourself to get rich off of me? Oh, you heartbroken because I found out you're toxic. I'm clear now. My third eye is open. All right? My third eye is open. My intuition's on point. All right, my my manifestation, my man, my manifest and the wisdom to manifest that bothers you. My faith, you better go and find somebody with crayons, cause I'm not finger painting with you. No, 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 no. Yeah, my higher self is active. My higher self is activated. Okay, I can't deal with foolery. They think you a fool, but they play. They do a lot of foolish things. The three of swords, the three of cups in reverse, the in and out energy. The bringing back the memories of when y'all used to be everything. Coming in, kissing your ass, okay? Because they broke, but behind the scenes, they've been trying to block you. It's played out. You're dodging them. And someone's heartbroken. I, I can't feel but to say collective. Someone's heartbroken, my dear collective, because someone sees that you found something out about them. And they want to say they're the ones heartbroken because you found out about them. They're having a tower moment. They're having a ten of swords. It's karma. Because this person does nothing but bring in, they, they, they're they like a, a vampire, I feel. One more spirit for the collective, please. Thank you, spirit. Mm -hmm. Y'all in the present moment are abundant and you have a lot of gratitude. Your face is immaculate. It's beautiful. Isn't immaculate a good word? I think it is. Even if it isn't, I mean it in a good way, y'all. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. The self-care is just winning by all costs, by all means. I mean, you moving in silence, not you trying to be mean or sneaky. You just trying to keep your energy separate from other people. You don't want to deal with the BS anymore. You're not interested. Okay. Somebody here is highly sexual. Yeah. They feel, they feel some type of connection here, like y'all are united together. There's no uniting. This person comes around, they take everything you got. Temperance in the reverse. They mad, they broke their own heart. They mad, they broke their own heart. How can you get mad at me for doing that to yourself? How can you have the audacity to get mad at me for that? Spirit, give me some for the self-care here. I love this card. What is that self-care? It's just, it just looks so pampering and loving. Yes, it's empowering you, my loves. Sun, strength, empowerment. A lot of you are empaths. I don't know why I feel um, you have sympathy for this person in a certain way or shape or form. But that's what they play on, my dear collective. You need to know. Someone needs to hear that. That's what they play on. Spirit's advising you to go on ahead and put the seven of wands up and start protecting yourself and your energy. Because someone here... They, they, they bring in this energy where they cannot just be by themselves. This person probably can't sit in a room by themselves quiet for 15 minutes without using a phone or messing with anything. They just don't know how. Yeah, y'all in separation. If you're not, they're going to be long for you when you're in separation because there's something here. You're more stronger than their limitations that they have on you. They don't want you to see that. So that's where that self-care comes in because you don't found out some secrets. Oh, my heart hurts. Why does yours hurt? What What happened? Oh, nothing, um, you know, just, you found out, you, you, you treated me bad, you know I'm not perfect, I get that, but you in a comfort zone, you trying to cling to me, honey, and I want nothing to do with it, my spirit God said to hell no, they don't want me to do that, no, my faith is strong, my, my higher self is activated, I care about me, 
and I'm closing out this cycle, period. Period. To hell with the offer. I'm avoiding that shit. Okay? I regret I even touched it. How about that? Yeah, the sex was good. Okay, you can say that. But this was just, this is about me trying to find me. This is me connecting with me. This is me getting to know who I am. I need to open up and receive the greatest good God has for me. Spirit has for me. Okay? Because I'm sitting here doing all this with you. And it's not getting nowhere. There's cards here, y'all. My cards are old. Shadow side just try to come out like that. But no. Hold up, Shadow. You can just stay back there. Open up and receive the best. That, look, Taurus Virgo Capricorn. You could be dealing with one or you could be that in your chart. Yeah, because they stuck in their shadow energy. Look at this. You open up receiving what you need to, okay, for your stability, for this Ace of Pentacles. Beautiful energy here. And someone's stuck in their shadow side. They're stuck with lack and doubt. Why? Because you're awakening to your spirit guides, to your faith, okay? You being stable, you being a stability, harmony, and flow energy triggers their inner child wounds. They might have abandonment issues. They might have codependency issues. Whatever it is, they cannot use you for the healing route. It's not going to work. You're going to get your wishes fulfilled, okay? You're going to have renewing, you're going to have a renewing spark of life. You're going to have a celebration, gifts, and abundance, but you got to be willing to make the change. Be courageous to go into union with people that really do have your best interest at heart. This is saying about love, partnerships, um, people that come from a genuine place, okay? Wordships or whatever. Learn to be cold and detach yourself from people that give you fake ass offers, fake belief systems, all that thing. All the things you don't stand for, detach yourself. Because someone's sitting here thinking your faith is funny. And I'm going to be honest, it's pissing me off. What it's doing is growing you. So when you detach yourself and become cold to these fake ass people with masks and shit, then you'll continuously see your growth. You will, collective. You will. You'll make it. This saying, oh, you ain't going to make it. You ain't going to be none. This person doesn't want you to be none. They see them came out. And now they done broke their own heart. Okay? They broke their own heart playing with you. Because you're a man or a woman of God. A spirit. You believe in it. You do. It's strong. But why do I get the feeling somebody makes fun of that and they think they have some type of tie to you? Okay? They might have a, there might be a soul tie, but this I feel like you guys, seeing the three of pentacles, I mean seeing the three of swords come out and then seeing the three of cups in reverse. This person has multiple soul ties. You're not their only one. It's time for you to do cord cutting so you can be independent and have that self reflection and be able to move forward towards your purpose in the present moment you're abundant you're thankful to god and spirit for everything you have because you're clearly you clearly can see who your higher self is it's being activated all this blocking you and all that stuff that is not going to do a thiti it's not doing anything all it's doing is blocking this person from having the best that they can be but look this ain't the army they got to do that on their own somebody have to actually look within themselves and see why they're having this situation yeah there's karmic friends and all that around this person the three of cups was in the reverse someone's upset because you're dodging them and stuff like come on i'm gonna dodge that i'm gonna dodge it what do you mean i'm not staying i'm not staying collective i love you so dang much y'all know it y'all know it y'all know it y'all know it mm. okay y'all continue to move forward okay love yourselves take care of yourself okay you're uninterested in in the in the gaslighting the the um the I love yous and I want to be in your life and hey, let me see what's in your bank account um, or what, you know, what do you have to offer me? Y'all know what y'all have to offer. Nothing because you're uninterested. I kept seeing all the queen cards in the upright and all the uh, masculine, the king cards in the reverse. Masculine, feminine energy. Take what side you're on, loves, Okay. The male could be actual feminine, and that's okay. I think that's very beautiful. If I might sit here and lie to you, I would say, oh, I don't like that. I love it. Okay, guys? And I love you guys even more, y'all. Someone, You're not confused about something anymore. It's in the reverse here. They're curious about why you're not confused. Y'all, yeah, 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 yeah. Y'all do what you want with that, loves. I love you so much. Thanks for joining the channel. Have a beautiful, beautiful, blessed day. Happy Tuesday, guys. See you later. Mwah. Bye.